Hey everyone, I'm Keychain. So I was out of town this weekend and I did not record a video yet for the new Easter Feast 50% event. Um, I'm going to go over that real quick and the new format. Now the thing I don't like about this right off the bat is in the other versions of the 50% event you can check the things that you do or don't want and it moves them up and down the list. There's no option to do that here. So I have to scroll through the list to get to the things I want and to filter through stuff whereas I didn't have to do that previously. And I hope that this is just part of their whole Easter thing and it goes back to their format, but you never know. So getting into it, there is the bakery where you're getting these baked goods that you use for items. And then the florist shop, which is the free shop. Um, now in here, they have the spring fairy portrait. And again, they've made it so the female portrait is free using flowers and the male portrait you have to pay for or purchase using the quest items or you know money shop items which hopefully they switch those in one of the upcoming events when they do it but you know for now it is what it is um everything looks pretty much the same over here they've got the resources some speed ups precision parts there's the Wildfire Senate Scrolls, um, Sky Silver, Rose Curiosities, all that. Now, if you don't already have these things, um, I would buy your Rose Curiosities and your Sky Silver, all that stuff. But they just updated um, the Ultimate Alliance campaign to give Sky Gold. So you're going to be getting that for free. I would, unless you're really really need sky silver or you're close to it i would avoid this one um and just wait for uac to get some sky gold i will be buying all of the copper essence the ebony essence the teleports probably the vip um i'm banking that up just for in the future if they ever decide to increase the vip levels i would rather have a stockpile of hundreds of thousands of vip points instead of having nothing um so that's something I'm doing. Now let's get into the bakery and we can explore the options in here. So they've got this um, Moy Mystery uh, portrait and it's now called a skin, which usually when you unlock the skin, you unlock the title and, and whatever goes with it. But it doesn't show what the benefit is. So I don't know how to find that. Um, I've got to explore the new system and see if I can figure it out. And then the Soul Reaper portrait. We've also got the double golds, um, other standard stuff. You can buy marquee badges, aristocrat badges. Um, what else is in here? Speed ups. You can buy all the materials that you would possibly need. They have the Valkyrie Curiosities is, is the large purchase item this time at 125 And then if you don't have Kingmaker, Kingmaker is down to 25 which is um, almost one of, the, one of the best deals that they have is when items are 25 for 10 Same thing with the Sky Gold. And then they did the same thing with having Trance and Phantom still in here. Um, Phantom, I get it, it's new, but... They still have the trance scroll, um, advanced scrolls kind of hidden in there. So make sure you know which ones you're buying if you do decide to go for the gems and you don't get confused by the pictures or thinking, oh, it's a good deal. And then you buy the wrong ones. And then there's Fire Demon in here, Silver Dragon Elixirs. 20 of these for one seems a little steep, but, you know, it, it's... It's gambling. You, you might get something good. I don't know if I'll purchase any of those. They have all of the blood tooth stuff. <clears throat> Intensity gears, um, advanced teleports, etc. So I, I'm actually going to buy all these right now. Um, I like to buy the, the top intensity gears when I if, I if I'm getting a lot of these currency. Um, because the last 50% event was so recent, I don't know what I will or won't be able to upgrade. I also did do some upgrades during the 
pirate event um, thinking that we had a long time until the next 50% event. So I'm kind of lower on materials than I should be. Now the other thing in here um, that I wanted to cover is this Easter egg hunt. You finally got the stuff for the Easter eggs. And this $5 column on the right side here, these, these two columns on the right, you unlock both of those for $5. And looking through here, at a quick glance, I just don't think it's worth it. Um, someone, you know, you may disagree with me or someone might actually do the value of all of the things in here. But at a quick glance, I don't see the value. I don't see $5. Um, so I will not be purchasing it. These quests usually go up to 30 lines i think um and they they have an extra you know 10 steps of reward that kind of break make the the break even point for me um i just i don't see it here so if you disagree let me know in the comments um and and why um but when i go through it's like getting some of these you know the hot cross buns i mean it, you can get 22 of them for a dollar and there's not even that many in there. You can get 30 recruitment banners for a dollar. Um, and some of these other things, it's like if you add them all up, they're they're less than what's in a dollar pack. And they don't even give you as many as you get in a dollar pack. So I just, yeah, don't see the value there. Um, I think I will do some of my own upgrades real quick. Um, I'll go over shooting gallery. If you haven't watched my video in the past, I'll show you how I do my shooting gallery and you know you can decide if you like the way I do it or not and how I kind of maximize. Ooh, I almost missed 80 gold there too. So when I do shooting gallery, I like to set the rewards for the top three to be what I want. And since it's curiosities today, we'll set curiosities. And I think... I should probably see exactly what I'm short on, but I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to go for it. So here, the top three lines are the most important, the three that I'm after. So I've got 11,000 of the copper essence, 18,000 copper essence, and then the ebony essence. The ebony essence is the quote-unquote quote, um, top prize in this. So if I get the top prize in my first or second click then I'm going to reset. So here I didn't, so I'm going all the way up to three. So that's six coins spent to get the top three prizes, and then I'm going to reset. And I'm going to start it right back up. So here I got the expected order, and here's where I broke it. So I got the top prize before having to do three. So I'm going to reset here, because if I do the third click, it's going to be the 18,000 copper essence, which is only valued, quote unquote, valued at two coins rather than three coins. So that's kind of how I, I do my, um, what's it called, my shooting gallery. And then I just keep going until I am close to a reward that I want, which I didn't pay that much attention to the tiers. I'll go out in a second and look at the tiers. I knew I had 90, I think I had 97 when I started. Oh, I shouldn't have clicked that. This one was, <laughs> this was a very exceptional pull. Um, so see that 90,000, that's the fourth tier prize. Um, I should have stopped right there because that would have gotten me huge value, but I was just um, kind of blazing through it, talking over it. And let's see, let's see how close I am to a reward. So I need to spend eight more coins. So it's either doing eight, eight and stopping or doing 42 so let's see if we end in a good spot after we do some of these now the other thing to look at is see how the rewards changed when i left and came back in so i have to reset these up to be what i want which would be this so we need to spend eight more so that was six right there and then this would be well, that's the third tier prize on the first pull. So you benefit by gaining additional coins. So then here, if I just use one coin, um, that puts me dead on the reward, and that's it. 
I'll stop there. I'm going to do some curiosities. Um, I think I have upgrade materials, and it looks like these go pretty high. So I'm not going to do pre-math. I'll do post-math. Um, what I mean by that is sometimes I can come in here and figure out exactly where I'm going to land when I have a lot of materials. Jeez, I do not have many materials compared to these new things. Like... Man, I can only upgrade the older pieces here. And it looks like I can't even do many of them. So I can't even do an upgrade of a basic pouch for the new curiosities. So I definitely am in need of the copper essence. So needing 1.4 million of those, I just... <laughs> I'm definitely short on that. Um, looks like I can upgrade a flawless or precious of the old style. Um, and I don't know how many points that's going to be. So I guess I am doing some pre-math. And when I do my math for these, I go into the score and I see what I have points for and how much of a score it's going to get me. So I can do a precious to flawless which would be 1.6 million points or I can do a flawless to a rare which is 2 million points so then let's look and see where that kind of lands so it looks like the 1.4 million tier here is what I should aim for so I should go from precious to flawless let me make sure that I don't screw this up so scrolling back down here precious to flawless is 1.6 million so that's what we're going to do on this one and what are my options here? Distance or infantry? Or cavalry, which, but that's flawless to rare. So precious to flawless, I'm gonna do infantry, infantry precious to flawless. And that should have gotten me just above that 1.4 million tier, which it did. And that's all I'm gonna do for today's challenges. Um, I will do guard recruits, but I'm going to do them all in one video so that if that's something you want to see, you can watch me do like 55 or 60 of them at once. Um, I honestly, I think that's it for this video. Um, thank you for watching. I appreciate the uh, support. Sorry for being late on the video. I was just out of town and trying to reco record and post a video out of town would not have been of sufficient quality so i decided to wait two days and post it up when i got home all right um see you guys in the next video thanks for watching